Welcome to the Hydraulic Press channel. Today we are going to crush some books. <laughs> I actually crushed books earlier this week and I got some great results. And when uh, inspecting the footage at home, I got the idea what would happen if we would pile up many books and crush them all together. How bad it's going to be? Are they going to explode together? or one by one, what's going to happen? At least it's going to be a huge mess, so it should be a pretty goddamn good video. I think I'm going to start with two and then increase amount of the book as long as we can. That's the plan. Okay, two books and these are like, I'm not sure what is this called. It's like a soft cover. I have found out that these explode better. And I think these are going to be slightly weaker to get dirt than one by one or easier to explode. I don't have force sensor, but I can like have a look on the pressure meter and give estimations. Okay, here we go with the two books. Okay, 70 tons. It's going. <laughs> oh shit. Okay, that's not good. Uh, the explosion was so hard that the one of the hoses came off. Yeah, that's used for like the side like lifting the table. Uh, yeah, let's have a short break and I try to fix it. And I couldn't fix it on the same day because the hardware stores were already closed and I need some spare parts, so let's continue on the next day. Okay, new day, same problem. Uh, the hardware store was already closed when I was filming, so I couldn't get the spare part yesterday. But now I have spare parts and this used to be here and it was attached to this with simple connection that needs this end to be like cone shaped but uh, constant pressure shocks were like hammering this end and it wasn't anymore the right shape so it just flew out but now I have this thing here, I can show. This is like, uh, I'm not sure what is the English name. It's like a pressure fitting. It like somehow grips the steel pipe when you tighten it. So now I don't have to have the cone shaped thing on the, this, it's good as it is now. And then the other end, seals right here. So this should be like bolt-on replacement. So it's relatively easy fix. And I bought two of these because I think I have the same problem on the other side. Because when the thing that I'm crushing explodes, the table shoots up and that generates pressure shock to uh, top part of these like lifting cylinders and that's why that's why it's broke but luckily luckily we can fix it uh, I think that's tight this apart this goes here that goes there then just this is now a bit too long, maybe, but I think it doesn't matter. I'm not sure how tight, how tight 
this should be, I, I make it pretty tight. Uh, I think that's really tight. And I think I'm going to test this. So I'm going to leave this camera on and I go lift the table and you can, you can observe will this leak. It shouldn't leak. And there might be some, some like weird stuff happening because the hose is empty, so there's some air on the system. Okay, I, I go have a look. Yeah, that was easy fix. Let's keep crushing. Okay, and now the question is, if two books were enough to break the press, what's going to happen with four? Okay, this looks bad. I think nothing broke. I'm going to take the ladder and go have a look on the uh, fixed hose. Yeah, and the hose was completely fine. And I think you can see here that it doesn't even move that much when these go. I think it's like depends on what kind of luck do you have when things explode, that how much of pressure shock it's going to generate. But it doesn't look super bad right now. Maybe these are a bit softer than the uh, just two books. So it doesn't like bend the table so much and it doesn't shoot up, up so much. But the books fly nicely, that's sure. Okay, this is all that I have left. Six books. And I can't really fit more here. I don't want to lower the table. I think it makes the piston too like wobbly for this kind of stupid load. And I'm quite afraid that these are going to fly out. So I put the backstop there. And on the front here is only cameras and the blast screen. So books are welcome to come. And, <laughs> and this is probably a bad idea, but I promise to keep going as long as we can, so here we are. It's ready. I think it's ready. There is only one book left. a huge mess. Like books and half of the books. Stuff like this is everywhere. <laughs> yeah, but I think this was a great video. The press is still working, as you saw. And the books, they just explode one by one. So more book, more explosions. So great idea. Yeah, and that is all for today. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.